Hello everyone. I'm here with the old Toshiba L505 DS5965. You never seen this guy in a while, haven't you? I'll go ahead and boot it up and I'm gonna show you what I've done. Okay, I'm powering it on. As you see it's booting up. Yeah, this is the laptop I fixed the power adapter on. You know the little jack that you plug your adapter in? It's on this side. And I'm also dual booting Windows 7 and Windows XP on this laptop. And I use it sometimes now since I fixed it and added some upgrades. It's starting up. And yes, it's running Windows 7 Professional 64 bit. I'm using a genuine copy of Windows 7 because I'm not using the ones off the internet for a download. <laughs> because the pirated copies of Windows 7 don't fully work that good. Lol. Here's all the programs that I would use. I'm going to show you that I upgraded the RAM in this. Let me focus the camera a good bit. Yeah, I need to clean this laptop screen. It's full of smudges. Yeah, and I installed Windows 7 on it like Friday, Windows 7 Professional. And I um, installed XP Thursday night. Let me go ahead and zoom in. And the copy I bought came with Service Pack 1. So there was no need to install Service Pack 1 separately. In my Windows indexing experience, I mean, Windows Experience Index is 3.7. And now I'm at 4 gigabytes of RAM. I, it used to have 3 gigabytes, so I added another, two, I took the 1 gigabyte stick that was in it and added a 2 gigabyte stick. And as you see, it's using 3.5 gigs. And this is an AMD laptop. And as you see, I also got Windows XP mode. And I got the updated version of Avast. And I will show you XP mode in a different video. And I even got Office 2010 Professional put on it. And if you want to see XP running, I will do a video of it running on this laptop. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to talk to you guys later. Just to give you the heads up what I've done to this laptop since I fixed it. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.